Wait, I think I am lying. Oh no, it's a different, it's a, it's a different material in the pants. That's why it feels different. It's thicker. Um, why are you getting rid of clothes? Because I moved in with my boyfriend and his kids and I don't have, I don't have room for all of this stuff and I don't wear a lot of it anymore. So here we go. This is number one jumpsuit, black sweater jumpsuit. Probably again, uh, an eight, six or an eight. Uh, okay. Number one, black sweater jumpsuit. Number two jumpsuit is from currently one of my favorite um, clothing sto online stores. Um, it's a woman owned and woman run. It's called Dressed in Lala. And I get a lot of my um, cute little fashions from them. When I buy something new, it's usually from them. Um, and this, uh, they used to have, they used to not allow returns. Um, and so I missed the window for this one and it still has the tag on it. Um, it's a medium and I have trouble with jumpsuits because I have a very long torso. So sometimes they ride up on me and it's not cute. I'm going to move this back a little bit. Um, so here is this jumpsuit with adjustable straps and when you wear it it goes very low it goes very low in the back so this is open it is a pant suit but it looks like a dress because of this sheer overlay so like the under part is fitted and then the top overlay is very like billowy so it's very sexy with that low back it has a zipper in the back as well this is jumpsuit number two it also has pockets has pockets it also has pockets jumpsuit number two sheer and sexy dreams this is another one back in the day that I bought and um, couldn't return. It is a medium. It is a cream colored denim jumpsuit with brown stitching. It has pockets. It has a thick tie of a belt around the waist. These cute little like billow sleeves, a zipper in the back and it's uh, a wide leg moment. Now that I have nothing left to lose. I need Jeremy to sing it. We also have the, the stitching detail all the way down. So here's jumpsuit number three. Cream, cream colored ponies and crip, crisp, crips. <laughs> no, not that. That was number three. Number four is a romper. I've worn this for many a concert. Um, it's giving Chicago vibes, right? It's BCBG, Max Azria. It's a small. It has this little keyhole in the front, which you can undo. It has a hook and eye so that it can open. Oh, a little bit of a, billow, a bell sleeve shorts. Okay. What? This is the back. Look at how sexy and beautiful. Max Azria, size small, romper number four. Number five is also a vintage number. I can't find the belt. It did come with a belt. But this is a straight forward. It fits straight at the waist like a trouser. It's not oversized. It fits like a suit trouser. Um, and, uh, there's a zipper. How do you get into, oh, there's a zipper here in the front, the front zip y'all. Very cute. Um, it's, it's just like very well made. Obviously vintage stuff is just well made. Here we go. This is jumpsuit number five. Again, with the size, this says it's a size 10. So 
but vintage size compared to today is not really the same, but here's a uh, number five. Okay, now this is the one that Mary Page has put dibs on, but I'm gonna put it on here in case it doesn't fit her. This is one of my favorites that I have had for years and I've worn the shit out of it. Just let's call her Goldilocks, okay? Cute little bell sleeve that comes to your elbow. A tie, this, this comes, it, it's like an empire waist, so it does come higher than you think. You can drawstring it, and it's a wide leg jumpsuit. Um, Alex Coleman of California, dry clean or hand wash. Let's call it a uh, sunrise surprise, okay? Uh, sunrise surprise. That was number six. That was jumpsuit number six. All right, last one. Oh, I forgot that. Last one is, I also got this at um, a thrift store with Natasha Diaz on tour with Falsettos. She wasn't on tour, but we went to DC where she lives and we went shopping one day. And this is a super cute Banana Republic size 10 uh, jumpsuit. It has this sweet little detail around the waist. It has pockets. It's wide leg and um, very flattering shoulder that you can put off the shoulder or keep it on. Um, this is the last jumpsuit. I have one more that's actually a dress that I forgot. This is also BCBG Max Azria. It's a size six. As we can tell, I vacillate between the size six and size 12. Um, <laughs> that's where all these sizes are gonna be, either six to 12 um, and, and everything in between. This is a, oh wait, I had another jumpsuit. Anyway, I'll, I'll talk about this one first. Um, this, is a, this is the front. It's sheer in a V all the way down with these little moments. This is the coolest. It's a mini skirt. And then this overlay. So it's a, it's so cute. Size six. Um, jumpsuit. eight. You guys, this isn't even half of it. Okay. I, th I'm just taking you back here because I thought I had one more. Oh, I have, oh, oh, I'm not done with the dresses. Here's another jumpsuit. So jumpsuit number nine. This is also Max Azria size six. This one is so beautiful. It has this, you can't really tell, but this like, this uh, detail here. It comes around this sheer little bib. It comes around to the back and gives you, what? Elekonomen vibes. This back is completely open. This closes up here with three buttons. So it's this like open and it's a jumpsuit size six. So this is number nine. I'm going to do some more dresses back here. Jumpsuit number nine. Jumpsuit number 10. Y'all, if you've known me at all, you know, and I've worn this 800 million times. It is one of my favorite things I've ever owned. Look at this, it's a coveralls. Look at this detail, this little crown with this belt that fastens in the front. It's this mustard yellow. It's oversized, um, so 
I would say a 10. Um, I wasn't always a 10, but it, it looks like baggy and I like roll the, roll the, the legs up. Ooh, what did we say this one was? Let's call her mechanic, mechanic chic. Okay. Hawaiian dreams. Purple and fuchsia. 80s to the max. Uh, pockets. Zipper in the back with a button closure. And it fits just like right at the ankle. I've worn this in the summer in Hawaii. I've worn it for a show. It's just the cutest little Hawaiian dream number. If you guys, if I messed up the numbers, which I know I did, remember the little nicknames that I gave it. That was Hawaiian Surprise. That was my bathroom. Okay. We have more dresses back here that I forgot about, you guys. And then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call it for the day. And then tomorrow I am going to come back and put the rest of it on because I have skirts. I have sweaters and jackets um, and some shirts for tomorrow. Also sweatsuits. Don't be mad. Okay. I don't know what we, okay, let me see about some questions. Let me see, let me see. Request to join. You can't join my live because, what was your favorite song on Tangled? Uh, Waiting in the wings. Um, this is a cute little summer dress. Um, let's call her Calico. Let's call her Calico. Oh yeah, we wanna see the sweatsuits. Tomorrow, I will put the sweatsuits on tomorrow cause I just don't wanna, I don't wanna go too long on all these lives. Uh, Mary Page, I, I don't know if this one will fit you, but it's lavender. Do you like lavender? Um, okay, let's call her Calico. She's really cute. It's a size 10, but it's not a size 10. It's probably more like an eight. Do I still have the black dress with the fringe? Yes, and I'm gonna tell you about it right now. Hold on, there's another question. What was the size of the Sunrise Surprise? Oh, Sunrise Surprise? Was that this one? Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm so bad at this. I'm so bad at this. Take a screenshot from my live and then let me know. This is not, this is a 10 or an eight. Um, Calico, kitty cat. I don't know. Ugh. This dress is a pencil dress, but I mean, look at this. It has pockets. It's navy blue with this cream piping. It's missing one of these amulets here, but uh, it's so, and it has a little tie that goes around the waist. This is Boogie Woogie Bugle Boy. Boogie Woogie Bugle Boy. Um, did someone take your Brooklyn jacket? No, no, because I feel like I should try and like auction that one off. Yellow jumpsuit with the flowers. Yes, yeah, sunrise surprise. Um, that is a probably a size eight, um, but it's baggy. Um, you know, it's meant it's it's meant to be. It it fits closely up here, but it has a drawstring. There is a friend of mine who's also really looking at jackets tomorrow. Yeah, the jackets you're gonna die. You're actually gonna die. This is. <laughs> this is. Seam was my friend. Nobody ever treated me kindly. Daddy left early. Mama was poor. This dress, when I tell you the ruching on the sides and in the back is freaking, it fits like, oh my God. It's gorgeous. Obviously, this is leopard. We're going to call her, yeah, Allison Porter. Why are you just getting here? Look at everything you have. I have. I'll send you whatever you want. This is a 
Leopard Dreams. Long sleeve, it, it hits just barely below the knee. It's sexy AF. Okay, this was a, a jumpsuit that I bought on eBay that used to be wide leg pants, but I turned, because it rode up on me, remember I said my torso is so long, it rode up and was up my butt. I had it made into a skirt. So this is a maxi dress. This is the collar, the sweet little like V-neck. Um, there is a little, Oh, I had it fixed. There was a part, this is a definitely a handmade dress. Like somebody made this dress and it's not from a store. Um, but this fabric is just gorgeous and it's, it's just so good. There's part of me that wishes I would have kept it a jumpsuit, but I couldn't wear it because it went up my butt. But you can see the line here is, is where the skirt meets the top. Here's this fabulous. 70s dream. Remember these nicknames because we've obviously stopped numbering. This is the one that somebody asked about. A French connection. Um, US, what does that say? Eight. You remember that bodycon material? That's what this is. It's stretchy and thick. Um, I am 5'7". Whoever asked me how tall I am, I'm 5'7". It's stretchy and thick. Um, so it really like hugs and babe, babe, babe. I will say that I wore it twice and I got to a point where, you know, I don't really believe in the thing of like, oh, you're too old to wear that because it's about the spirit. But I just started getting uncomfortable because of my, the gifts I've been given it would make it very short in the back, like uncomfortably short for me. So this is a size eight French connection, body con fringe moment. Here's one of those 70s like moo-moos that are like chic. I love this dress so much. I got it at an estate sale. It's very comfy and soft, elastic around the arm that goes to just below the elbow. Um, yeah, you just throw it on. You can see all this detailing here. I will say that whenever I wore it, I would wear it sometimes with tights. It, it gets very static clingy. So it doesn't, it never fully like flowed the way I wanted it to. Um, because I don't know if you can tell here at the bottom, see how it's kind of like sticking to itself and it makes it look kind of weird like wrinkly it is wrinkly but it's like sticking to itself so the fabric is funny but it's super comfy even if you just want to like wear it around the house hi my name is strawberry shortcake i got this dress because i wanted to wear it over jeans and i did one time and that's it um so it's too small for me um Again, it's vintage, so they're, well, actually, it says it's a size nine, but it's not. I can guarantee that because I couldn't get this closed and because I would sometimes even wear it like all the way open with a cute like white little bralette. So this, and it's, um, this is the pattern. It looks like little rosettes, but it's not. It's like a dot and two little lines. Um, this is so cute. Love, love, love. Strawberry shortcake. This is like this onesie. It's one of those harem pant onesies. Ties around the neck, elastic down here, and then elastic on the feet. But then you can, you can tie it. How do you, I don't remember how it is that you do it, but you can roll it up in, into a ball in itself and tie it. And it's like supposed to be these like traveling pants. I don't know, but they're super cute. I've worn the shit out of them. I'm going to save this for skirts tomorrow. This is um, a gorgeous dress that I've used to wear it all the time. Look at the sleeve. I mean, come on. Elastic waist. 
Um, this pattern is just stunning. I've had it forever. I've worn it forever. It's long. It's about to my ankle. Daishiki Dreams. Daishiki Dreams. This was my grandmother's. And I have several of her clothes that, you know, don't fit me anymore or never fit me, but I just wanted them when she passed. This dress, um, I think it possibly came with a slip underneath it because as you can see, it's sheer. I have worn it with a bralette like over jeans. Um, it's like a dusty pink. Um, the sleeve is this, is this moment. Like you can see that your arm comes through here, but this is a thing. And then this is the top of the arm. So beautiful. Um, what did somebody say? Yes, I did wear that in Egypt. Um, so this is, let's say dusty rose and it has a little elastic drawstring waist and it better go to a good home because it was my grandma's um this is a, just another like 70s little house dress um here's the detail of the sleeve i've worn this just like to lounge around the house um i've also worn it over over jeans um super cute easy breezy House dress, 70s, that is really cute. I like the pink as well. Well, you guys can DM me and let me know. Um, this was another closet swap with Camila Marshall. Um, it is an extra large. And it's this cute little dress. And I've worn it um, by itself with like cowboy boots. But um, I will tell you, it's very, it's very, very roomy, but super cute, even in the roominess. Elastic sleeve. Um, it's just a cute little A-line dress. It has a tie in the back with this elastic. And it's cotton. It's from Target, I think. It could also be a shirt. It could also be jean shorts. But I got some good use out of this. This is Hawaii Five O. Let's call this Hawaii Five O. It says here it's a size twelve. It is absolutely not because <laughs> when I I would I would say it's closer to a a, a six, um, a six eight.
No? I think it's my blue. Hold on. Now, can you hear? Yes, hearing back on? Is the sound back out? Can you hear? Yes, okay. It was my it was my Bluetooths. I mean my ear. Okay, so if again, if you wore this as a dress, I want to see pictures because it the slit goes like the slits on either side go to like at the top of your what where like the bottom of your underwear might go depending on what style underwear you wear okay this is beautiful let's call her golden girls okay friends i don't want to overwhelm everybody so here's the end of my Yes, Mike, I wore that. I wore Golden Girls, that sparkly blue at my um, at my Vegas concert. You're absolutely right. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to be back and I'm going to show you some Ivy Park stuff that I have, skirts and coats. Um, the coats that I have, some of them are on eBay because they are collectors like Don Loper. Um, but I have so much to sell. Um, I have so many coats, obviously I, and, um, sweaters. That's what we'll be doing tomorrow. Um, DM me. Oh, also let's just talk about, I have some vintage Jimmy Choo heels. These are 37 and a half but they're not my heel. I wear a seven and a half. My heel is like ooh, barely hanging off the, like I haven't worn them because I'm like, do I look like I'm that, that person who's like trying to put their foot into it and it's hanging off and you're like, stop trying. Um, <laughs> so I have those vintage Jimmy Choo's as well. Um, the coats I have are fabulous. You're going to die. So tomorrow, I'll be back for sweaters, skirts, coats. Thank you for joining me. Let's do more closet swaps, closet sales. It's better for the environment. And uh, thank you for hanging in there. Wow, we did it.